I live streaming this this time? No. Okay. Good. So, I see Doug Trio. I never liked Doug Trio, but in this case, I think anything I have can pretty much wreck Doug Trio. So I'm not really, um, you know, worried about it. Uh, the lesson. I've never really fought them too many times, but the few times I have, they've been a pain, but it's okay. I think, what are they, specially defensive? I don't know. But, uh, it'd be great to trick one of them. It really would. But I'm going to lead off with Bronzong. He's probably going to get up his rocks. I'm going to do the same thing. It's a apparently, Cobalion is a... Oh! It's a Taunter! Okay. Okay, that's that's cool. Um... net leftovers okay I'm okay with this I guess so I expect it to switch out into what I don't know I kind of want to burn on something I just you know wait a second oh it's because the the ability transfers next turn the heck I don't know what I want to do with it now Well, this is really, like, less than awesome. I'm going to go ahead and hit one land, hopefully scare him out. Hopefully he doesn't do anything, like... He's going to Volt Switch. Okay. Now, what are you going to go into? A Moongus? Maybe put me to sleep, maybe? I don't know. I don't know. This is my spinner. So, I, I like to keep him healthy. And it appears that m basically everything on his team is, uh, special. You want to... Doug drill me up. I'm going to Ice Punch and bring it down the Sash, and then I'm going to Rapid Spin. Or I'm just not. Now I have to Mach Punch. There is no doubt that I have to Mach Punch. There is no spinning. I have to spin, though, at some point. Um, nothing on my team is weak to rocks, but rocks will wear me down soon enough. So I'd like to get them out before I die. So I may have to take him one land out here and look for a better opening for him, depending on what he goes into. If he goes into something slow, then that's good. Like, going, no, if he goes into the lesson, I can't. If he goes into Amoongus. Amoongus would be best case scenario if he goes into that, uh, and he's not going to go into that. Which is completely, completely understandable. I'm going to go into my own, ro my own Rotom. i got to stop putting up Skype like that. Like, Skype is, like, right down here, and I think it pops up in the video sometimes. I really got to stop doing that. Leaf Storm. Well, it wasn't really going to do much anyway. However, do I want to... Ooh. I'm going to trick it. Probably should have tricked something else. What do I get? Well, that was anticlimactic. I kind of want to... Just go for another trick. Expecting it to switch out. Perfect. I'm okay with this completely. Now I'm gonna wait. Oh, I got black sludge. Maybe I'm not okay with this. I'm gonna confuse ray it. Just to be annoying. Hopefully he, he like switches out in, the, in this like Cobalion or something. Nope. Either way, it helps. I'm okay if I let Rotom die here. I'll probably leave him for death fodder. To be, if I'm being like completely honest. question is, what is he going to do? I want to see what he's going to do. If, if he goes for like a sleep powder, then I'm then that sucks. Maybe don't hit Munchland. Hope he gets confused again. Confused again. Clear smog. Stats reset. Why? Did I set up? I don't remember setting up. I'm going to rapid spin now. We'll have to watch now for Cobalion to get in the Fugler, but that's fine. Gonna get rocks off the field, at least for right now. He's probably gonna kill me or get confused or something. No, he's gonna clear smog again. So, Cobalion come in set up a little bit later. Let me see something. Can Sharpedo sweep? No. If I get enough speed boost, he can really do some damage, though. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I want a Moongus weakened first. Let's get up my own rocks. No more taunter for you now, bud. 
But if I can bring in, like, Sharpedo on a... No, bringing in Sharpedo on a Moongus isn't really the best idea. Because even if the Amoongus isn't invested, if it has Giga Drain or even Sludge Bomb, it's going to hurt Sharpedo's frail little self. I need a Moongus, uh... I need a down on health. Then I could probably, uh, get a sweep with Sharpedo. It's possible. It's very, very possible. I'm going to go into this thing. This thing's normally a special attacker. Um... Normally I'd use this to wall Cobalion, but the thing is, uh, he has Taunt, so it doesn't really matter. So I could just let this thing die. I'd like to get off a Toxic on it, just to be annoying with it. He'll probably Shadow Ball me, I doubt it's going to kill. It's gonna, he's going to Scald, okay, he's going for like Burns or something. But honestly, honestly I'm okay with this. If he wants to stay in with this thing, I'm perfectly fine with uh, him doing that. Probably going to switch out now. Should I gyro ball instead? It's no way it's it's no way it's gonna go through this. It probably has toxic as well, so bronzong is in good shape here. Real good shape here. So I'm just gonna it gets a crit and a burn. Yo! One hax is enough. Expect him to switch out there. Guess he's not going to. The thing is, he has the ability to uh to recover. Let's go into Rotom Moa's death fodder. Maybe it won't even die. Who knows? It may take the Scald rather well. If it gets burned, then it'll probably die. Oh, what do you know? Well, this is less than convenient. Kind of confuse Ray. And let Rotom die. Get a free switch into something. When Cobalion's out of the way, then x Cloud could come in and sweep. But if I could weaken Cobalion and Amoongus just enough, I could probably sweep with Sharpedo. So, is it possible to get into one of those positions? I have a lot of options. Can I capitalize on it? Is the question. Be really annoying with Confuse Ray. And now, uh. I want to Volt Switch. I'm going to Volt Switch. I guess I'll keep this thing alive just for, you know, death fodder down the road. That worked out pretty well. That worked out very well, actually. I'm pretty positive now I could set up that Larpedo sweep. I just need to get a speed boost off. Amoongus, however, is still at full, so uh, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Close combat? No. Now, he is a little bit at a little bit more than I would have hoped. So, just to be safe, not slash me, I'm too used to Twitch, I tell ya. I'm gonna calc this really quick, really quick. I can't even spell Slurpedo. Go, go. Why Why is Caps on? UU Cleaner, Waterfall's on there, Sweet, Life Orb's on there, Cobalion. Uh, it's not Swords Dance, I'm gonna go with Support here. Can a Waterfall, how much does a Waterfall do? Does not do enough. If this thing is HP invested, it could be defense invested or something. I don't even know what Cobalions run. YOLO. That was the worst possible way to YOLO. It's gonna Volt Switch. Oh, but I live though. You're gonna go into Amoongus. Amoongus is his best bet. You can't go into anything else but Amoongus. But then I can weaken Amoongus with a Crunch, and then X Plot can come in and basically wreck shop. And then if so, maybe later on, Bennett can kind of wear everything else down if anything's going to survive. Explodes Raid! I do need Cobalion out of the way. What am I talking about? Because he outspeeds with close combat. Cobalion needs to go. Then Explode can destroy everything. But until Cobalion's gone, I can't. However, getting this thing weak is something I really want to do. So I'm going to crunch it. Probably Giga Drain. It's not going to get much health back, so... I'm not too, too worried. But a crunch should do reasonable damage. Reasonable. I'd hope so, at least. Reasonable. Very good. What's it going to do now? It's going to Giga Drain. That's fine. Not going to get too much back. I'm going to start boom bursting things. He'd be a fool to switch out into Cobalion. He's probably going to go into Cobalion now. Then I'm going to go out into uh, Rotom, Sack it, then go into Bennett, 
Shadow sneak it. See, it's good to keep it's good to keep death fodder around, isn't it? Oh yeah, a shadow sneak will kill. A shadow sneak will totally kill. See, this would be nice to have like hit one around. Honestly, I assume that he's going to go right into uh, Meloetta here. But even if he does have a shadow ball, hmm. Should I be Tleaky and Will O Wisp? I can't think that he's gonna save this thing. If he goes into Meloetta, he's like super MLG Pro Strats. Okay, sweet. Thing is, if Meloetta had a shadow ball, I could let it hit me once. Then Debon the next turn. No, Rotomo. I think Rotomo's gonna do a lot. Let's go for a knockoff. I don't think it can one hit me. Unless it gets like a crit, I don't think it can one hit me, even with a Leaf Storm. Meloetta, if that thing's bulky, then I may have a problem with Exploud, but it can't one hit Exploud. So I should be okay. That's what I thought. I think I could Shadow Sneak, actually. Let's do that. I think that'll kill. Let's hope it kills. Knockoff was in Stab. It still did a good amount. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to assume Shadow Sneak's going to kill. Yes. Now, if he goes to Meloetta, I could debond. Please go into Meloetta. If he goes into Meloetta, I win. There's no doubt about it. I win. He can go into whatever he wants, honestly. I'm pretty positive I have this in the bag. Probably gonna go for a skull, I'm gonna go for a debond. Then I'll probably wear Meloetta down with Bronzong just to be uh super positive. Bronzong would probably die to be honest, if it had Shadow Ball, probably. Yes. Going to Bronzong now. Just to get off like a toxic or something, get off like as much like damage as possible on this thing, just to make sure that boom burst is gonna kill in one hit or something. Honestly, I should probably go for the Gyro Ball. It'll do more than Toxic. Because I only have like a turn to work off of here. Either way, I think I'm dead right here. Unless it doesn't have Shadow Ball for whatever reason. If it, has, if it doesn't, it's going to Relic Song? Oh boy, oh boy! Guys, here's the thing. That thing probably has Close Combat. If so, then I lost. It has knockoff. Oh boy. Does it have close combat? Does it have close combat? Oh no! It has to have close combat. I forget that the second form is a thing. I had this all planned out, then I realized something. This thing's a threat to Exploud as well. And I'm not, like, scarfed or anything. Does it have close combat? It has to have close combat. This is Lee Lee. If it doesn't have close combat, though, I win. No! It got a crit. I don't think it mattered. Either way, it's Lee Lee. Ooh, I'll play it at the end there. Good on ya. What was his name? Grudo Misfit? I think that's his name. I think that's how you say it. Outplayed. See, guys. You always gotta remember everything. Because the one thing you forget or the one mistake you make will cost you. I would have played a little bit safer if I would have remembered that that thing has a secondary form. It's just when I use it, I never use the secondary form. I only use the special form. Just cuz. Dang it. Dang it! Either way. I would have kept him on Jan around. Or at least, you know, played him, played safer with him. But either way. It was still nice and close. So no problems here. I'll see you guys in the next one.